The Children's Friend Foundation is an organization dedicated to helping children and families who may be suffering from the impact caused by the disease of addiction. For the past eight years, we have partnered with the Utah High School Film Festival in the Addiction Prevention PSA Scholarship category. We invited student filmmakers to explore the role of relationships in preventing addiction and supporting addicts in their recovery. We encouraged our high school filmmakers to research and think deeply about making a film that would touch the heart and move people to action. Henry Ford said, coming together is a beginning, staying together is progress, and working together is success. He reminds us that taking a journey is better together than apart. We are proud of our four winning high school filmmakers and their associates. Marie and I want to thank the contributors who have provided the scholarship funding for our foundation. Here's our 2019 High School Film Festival winners. No one is lonelier than the addict. No cipher, no shut-in, no convict. Doesn't matter the walls, the halls, or the context. Addicts get lost in the vortex of a substance, a powder, a pill, a hypodermic. This isolation is a matter of the limbic, but it's the heart that needs connection, the soul that needs collection. Together, we are a force to be reckoned with in any fight against addiction. Words are powerful tools. I'm going to say a word, and I want you to think of what emotion the word gives you. Ready? Ocean. Sunshine. How about this one? Addiction. A lot of people suffer from this word, but we can change it. When we all give love and support, we can stop addiction. When we use words of kindness, help, and acts of love, we can save each other. Together. Together, let's use our words to stop addiction. Hi, my name is Dustin Barker, and I am an opiate addict in long-term recovery. Roughly 15 years ago, I was playing college football in California when I had an injury and a doctor prescribed me Oxycontin that I instantly became addicted to. Connection has been one of the important parts of my recovery. Connection to myself, connection to my higher power, and connection to my loved ones as it helps keep me grounded, humble, and grateful for everything I have today. Over 25 million people in the United States currently need help for addiction and drug abuse, and less than 10% of those are currently getting the help they need and deserve. Without the love and support of my family and friends, there's no way I would have been able to get through my addiction. They loved me when I didn't love myself. Life was never meant to be lived alone. It was meant to be lived together. January 15th, 2019, It's when I lost my cousin to suicide. Yes, drugs and alcohol were an influence and did play a big factor in this, but Brooklyn was just your normal everyday teenager. Everything about her was just amazing. But now, it's time to come together and be one. It's time to help each other, 
It's time to love each other. And most importantly, it's time to come together. So let's go have fun together. Let's go on adventures together. And let's all be friends together. And most importantly, let's all love together. We can change the world together.